hello guys and welcome back to another video and we're back with the command block tutorials and this time it's mainly not that much command blocks it's just uh, basically creating ranks on your server and having all the prefixes before your names like where if I type it just says my name and it doesn't say what rank I am because of course I'm owner and I want people to know that I'm actually owner rank so in order for us to do that we need to create some teams using the scoreboard so if we do scoreboard teams it then tells us the commands we can use with teams so there's list there's add remove empty join leave option list basically lists all the teams you've got add adds a new team remove removes the team that you already have empty basically kicks everyone out of that team join makes you join a team leave makes you leave a team an option gives you all the options for that team so let's create a few teams now so if we do add and now this is the name of your team so let's do owner let's do member just for the default players admin and let's just do a mod and now i can make myself scoreboard teams join owner now i'm in the owner team but nothing's changed it you can't tell that I'm actually in the owner team and in order for us to change that we'll need to use a program called MBT Edit or MBT Explorer and once I've gone over to that I'll show you how to add things like prefixes and suffixes but first I'm just going to show you some of the options uh, teams option so these are the options you can choose you can choose friendly fire color see friendly invisibles so friendly fire uh, you got to do your teams let's do owner friendly fire um, you can choose either true or false true means everyone on the stat team can hit each other false means they can't so let's set that to false because we don't want them to kill each other um, or since I'm the only owner I don't want to be if I ever make someone else owner I don't want to be them to hit so I'll do the same for the other ranks so admin uh, you got it's capital sensitive as well. Uh, let's do mod and member because we don't want anyone to hurt each other. Next, we want color. Uh, oops, owner color. Color is only used if you don't if you want to sort of distinguish between them, but you don't want a prefix. So say I wanted owner to not have a prefix. I would do color red. Now, if I type, my name is red, but obviously there's no prefix. So if I change it to say blue, I'm now blue, light underscore purple, I'm now pink or light purple. But if we remove the, well, you can see all the colors, you can do reset to make it go back to white. Um, and there's that's basically the colors and finally we have C invisibles C friendly visibles um, you can change that to true or false I think this is if I scroll up there's actually it doesn't tell you anymore there's also name tag visibility visibility but C friendly visible is basically if someone on your team is invisible you'll be able to see them so I'm gonna set that to true just so I can see any other owners that are um, on the server even if they're in like vanish or something even though you can't get vanish on vanilla unless you give yourself an invisibility potion um, and finally name tag visibility you can set that to always so it'll always show your name um, above your head so above my head it would say game motion um, never means no one will ever be able to see your name tag Hide for other teams means everyone on your team can see your name, but no one else can. And hide for own team means everyone else can see your name, but people on your team can't see your name. And that's basically the options. So now I'm going to go over to the program, which um, the download link will be in the description, which will let you edit the prefixes of your teams just to show people who what rank you actually are. Okay guys, I'm now on MBT Explorer as you see, and what this shows you is all of your worlds in your Minecraft um, save file, and I clearly have a lot, I have a lot of death run maps, um, quite a few command block mini game ideas, but what you want to do is find the world that you're using, and I'm using YouTube command block tutorials. 
uh, you want to open the little plus um, icon next to the name of your world and then you'll get a bunch of things like level, stats, region, player data, dim, dim dash one, well dim one, dim dash one and data and what you want to do is open data and then open scoreboard because this is all the data for scoreboards and then data again and now we have teams so these four nine en with nine entries are the four teams that we created member admin mod and owner so if we open one we see that this one display name is owner and the name of it is owner and here are all the properties of it and as you see here there's prefix and suffix and this is where we can edit either the prefix or the suffix so if we double click prefix we now have if i drag this into the screen we now have um the default prefix which is uh this symbol here and then an r so if we delete that now this is the part where you can put whatever you like but it has to be um short uh, 16 characters or shorter so it can it can't be just that because that's too long the maximum it can be is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 that's as long as it can be can't be any longer than that otherwise people that try and connect to your server will get kicked because it's just too long for Minecraft to handle so if we want this to be owner I'm gonna make it a nice red and bold so to make it red we need to hold down alt and press 2 1 on the numpad and that gives you this symbol and then you'll want to do C because C is the color code for red then hold down alt and 2 1 on the numpad again and then we get it again and then L so that L is the color code or code for bold and then we want to do owner and what you'll also want to do is do a space do alt 21 R because if you don't do a space then alt 21 R there won't be a space between your prefix and your name if you just left it like this there'll be no space if you try and put a space and then click OK um, MBT edit will just delete that space because it's not needed so that's why you do 21 R so then your name is um, the normal color suffix you can do whatever you want but I'm just going to keep it like that for now so now if we go into the next one mod I'm going to make this pink so 21 D 21 L mod space 21 R you can just copy and paste that um, code but I don't need to right now so now 21 I'm gonna make this green which is a admin R and finally we'll do member you don't have to have a prefix for member um, but to show suffixes I'm gonna do a suffix for member I'm gonna make it be 7 noob there we go without bold I might make it no I'll just leave it like that so once you've done that um, up here there's a little purple save button you want to click save and then you want to go back onto your Minecraft world you need to make sure that your world is not open which mine is so I'll need to quickly go close it otherwise it won't work okay guys I'm back on Minecraft and I did a quick test I just rejoined the game and because I was in the team owner we now have the prefix owner so if I do hello it will say owner game motion um, if I do scoreboard teams join member oh I did teams wrong temas teams join member and now it says game motion noob afterwards after my name because that's the suffix and as you see it's not bold if I join mod I'm now mod it also updates on the scoreboards at the side so I am a mod if I join admin I will get admin and it just basically shows everyone on your server who's the different ranks and it it makes it look nicer because I spelled it wrong oh no because it just looks more realistic you obviously don't need to, you don't need to put prefixes but it, it looks nice and you don't need to put suffixes either you don't have to put new you can put member at the front you don't have to have anything for normal players if you wanted and I think that's it for this video so thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video